Monocrystalline versus polycrystalline. Which solar panel is right for you? Polycrystalline solar panels. These panels are made from polycrystalline silicon, which is created by melting silicon and allowing it to cool into multiple crystal structures. Polycrystalline panels have a bluish color with a speckled texture due to the multiple crystals in each cell. Monocrystalline solar panels. Monocrystalline panels are made from a single, continuous silicon crystal. They are created by slicing high-purity silicon rods into wafers. These panels are typically black or dark blue and have a smooth, uniform appearance. Key features and comparison manufacturing process. Polycrystalline panels are produced by melting silicon and allowing it to cool, forming multiple crystal structures. This process is simpler and more cost-effective compared to monocrystalline panels, which require slicing high-purity silicon rods into wafers, making them more expensive to produce. Efficiency Polycrystalline panels have a lower energy conversion efficiency, typically ranging from 15% to 17%. In contrast, monocrystalline panels are more efficient, with rates between 18% and 22% or higher. Appearance Polycrystalline panels have a bluish color with a grainy, fragmented texture due to their multiple crystal composition. Monocrystalline panels, on the other hand, feature a sleek, uniform appearance, usually black or dark blue, which makes them visually appealing for residential and commercial applications. Performance Polycrystalline panels are less effective in low-light or high-temperature conditions, whereas monocrystalline panels excel in both scenarios, maintaining better performance in challenging environments. Lifespan Both types of panels have a similar lifespan of around 25 to 30 years. However, monocrystalline panels may retain their efficiency slightly better over time. Cost Polycrystalline panels are more affordable, making them suitable for budget-conscious projects. Monocrystalline panels, being more expensive, are ideal for installations where higher efficiency and aesthetics are priorities. Best use cases Polycrystalline panels are well-suited for large ground-mounted installations where space is not a constraint. Monocrystalline panels are better for rooftops or areas with limited space, as they generate more power in a smaller footprint. Advantages and Disadvantages Polycrystalline panels Advantages Lower upfront cost, making them budget-friendly. Environmentally efficient manufacturing with less material waste. Soft, natural look for large-scale installations. Disadvantages Lower energy conversion efficiency compared to monocrystalline. Greater performance loss in high temperature or low light conditions. Monocrystalline panels Advantages Higher efficiency Producing more power per square foot. Superior performance in varying light and temperature conditions. Sleek and elegant appearance preferred for residential and commercial rooftops. Disadvantages Higher initial cost Manufacturing generates more silicon waste. What should you choose? Polycrystalline panels, best for budget-friendly, large-scale projects with ample space, such as ground-mounted solar farms. Monocrystalline panels, ideal for residential and commercial rooftops or installations where space is limited and maximizing power output is critical. Both types have unique benefits. The choice depends on your budget, available space, and specific energy needs.